Yeah, this is from the neighborhood cat jump. And in this video, the genetic, historic, chronologic, and biblical evidence of Japheth as Cro Magnon and the Sumerian king list to put everything in perspective. Cat jungle, nigga. First, we must understand that Noah of the Bible, whose most ancient name is written in Sumerian as Zeu Sudra, represents Cro Magnon, which is to say the modern human bloodline of the Middle East. In another Sumerian text called Instructions of Kirapak, <clears throat> Zeu Sudra, whose Hebrew name is Noah, is inscribed as the son of Kirapak, who is in turn inscribed as the son of Ubara Tutu. Ubara Tutu or Ubara Utu appears in the Sumerian king list as the first and last dynasty to rule the city of Kirapak, which is named after his son before the great flood. So biblically speaking, Zeus Sudra would respond to Noah. And if Zeus Sudra responds to Noah, then his father Kirapak would respond to Lamech. And if Kirapak responds to Lamech, his father Ubara Utu would respond to Methuselah. Now, using the Sumerian king list, we find that Methuselah which is to say Ubara Utu, became king in 48,978 B.C. Now about 43,000 B.C., kings from the Ubara Utu dynasty began to expand into Europe. Japheth, the son of Noah, and the great-grandson of Ubara Utu was given Europe. And within 10,000 years, modern man, which is to say Cro-Magnon, the descendants of Noah, with their advanced culture, dominated the Neanderthals of Europe. But after 30,000 years of people who are more adapted to tropical environment, live in northern latitudes with colder climates, Less sunlight, which makes covering the skin with clothes a necessity, which creates even less contact and tanning from the sun. Less game to hunt, which leads to diets poor in vitamin D, which is processed better in cold, dark climates with white skin. So about 10,000 BC, the natural selection for the survival of the original dark skinned Europeans under these conditions caused the mutation of the SLC24A5 gene. This played a key role in the evolution of white skin in Europeans. 